bone marrow lesions are a, a key part of osteoarthritis. They are associated with pain, they lead to loss of cartilage in the knee, and they predict knee replacement. And, and they're very common in people with osteoarthritis and even the general population being present about 30% of those they aged over 50. So we've had no therapeutic options for those patients. Uh, what I've done in this study is show that zolandronic acid, which is a, an approved osteoporosis medication, which has a strong effect on bone cells, that when you give a single shot of that, you can improve pain and you can decrease the size of the bone marrow lesions. So this is the first time something's been shown to work. Uh, it's effective, uh, it's available, and we know it's safety. So I think if we've got people with bone marrow lesions, this is something that could be actively considered uh, to treat them at this point in time. So often with osteoarthritis, we've got very limited treatment options and at a rheumatology specialist level, I see patients who have not responded to normal therapies. Uh, so therefore, they're often saying, what can I do? Uh, so in this case, this would be an off-label uh, use of this medication, but you know, it's been around for a long time been used in the oncology and osteoporosis fields well, really for eight or nine years now so I know it's safety profile so I talk with patients and often they'll elect to pay for it uh, and it can make you know, quite large differences to pain which in this case obviously is what the patients want and because it's given once a year or once uh, every even once every two years in some cases uh, they get long-lasting uh, benefit from it.